busted, baby. <laughs> Good morning from Provincial Court. <laughs> Down at the traffic court this morning and loving life. Not usually you come out of traffic court and you're smiling. Don't mind the glasses, I had to look very professional this morning. So, caught speeding. Um, just a couple of blocks over here actually, on my way to work. Thought it was a little excessive. And one of my coworkers said, hey, go to traffic courts, fight the ticket. So I went in and told them that, uh, hey, I wasn't going that fast. I was at a red light. I was actually about four lanes across traffic, um, turning left, and the officer was standing on the corner trying to flag me over. And so they didn't stop me for about three or four more blocks. Um, that was actually my last video, so you should check that out. <laughs> But uh, yeah, so saw the justice of the peace. They saw how long expenses I had a ticket and went from, uh, well, I won't talk about how much the ticket was. It was very expensive, but uh, basically cut it down by $140 and cut the demerit points by half. So the maximum uh, is lose your license and a lot of points. Um, the minimum is two. And so they gave me two demerits and free to go. So that's my advice. Go fight your ticket. Thanks, boys. So, ticket paid, ticket reduced, points reduced and paid. And thought I'd give you a couple of tips on the uh, best way to go about this and get your tickets reduced and maybe get them uh, save some money so first thing come early um, courts open here about 8 30 I came like 8 40 no lineup got straight in waited for about three people and I was in as I came out at nine o'clock there is a full line to the door Cut off his ears, then Don't wait or you're gonna wait hours. So get there early. Number two, know the laws. So I know in Alberta at 15 kilometers over the speed limit, you start going from two to three demerits. Um, my ticket, I was over 40 over, so that was four demerits, which is just like getting two tickets, honestly. Um, so slow down or don't get caught. Um, so I explained to the Justice of the Peace that I hadn't had a ticket for a very long time, um, which is true. And she actually had my record open, so that was actually some handy advice. And I also knew the laws and how much the limits were and the tickets were. So she knocked it down to a sign violation, which is two demerits, and uh, dropped the ticket by about $140. So that was, uh, you know, the other part of my concern is how expensive this is. The other thing is, be prepared to pay your ticket or go to court. So there is not a justice in the traffic court who's going to say, no ticket for you today, thank you very much, see you later, unless there's a mistake on your ticket. So be very conscious of the handwritten part of your ticket. Everything has to be accurate, or you can argue the ticket is inaccurate, and then they can throw it out. Um, unfortunately, mine was uh, very thorough and was all correct, so couldn't go that route. Um, but like I said, if you're speeding, be prepared to admit you're speeding and be prepared to pay a reduced rate for your ticket. Um, you can pay it on the spot or you can also go and see uh, the cashier and try to make uh, some arrangements if you need more time to pay, which is also nice if you don't have cash on hand. Uh, and the last thing is going to court. Do some research. There's a lot of private companies, especially here in Alberta, who will help you fight tickets. Not necessarily lawyers, but... Uh, ex-police, you know, all these kinds of businesses. Their websites are loaded with information. So go there, do your homework, and uh, do the best. 
this is pretty good actually. I'm pretty happy today. Uh, I haven't had any points on my license for a very long time, so that was a plus. And that's it for now. Thank you to the Provincial Court of Alberta, wherever you are, over there. And uh, drive safe, everybody. <laughs> I don't know if I'll slow down, but I'll, I'll drive smarter. Now I know one more hiding place. If you're driving in Calgary, 9th Avenue, Staples, heading right into the core. That's where they like to hang out there or at the bus. So slow down by the time you get to the bus depot. Everyone, uh, thanks for watching. Talk to you again soon. Cheers. And your day. Chop, chop.